initially we thought of it as cool, I'm blind, I'm buying a ticket to an event. It might be at the International Convention Center, say in Sydney, for example. On the event page, the person who's legally blind, they're going to use a screen reader, which means on their phone, it will read to them what's on the website. Most websites aren't built for that. They're not web accessible. And so when they click text to voice, it doesn't read it in the right order. It misses things because maybe something was text in the image as opposed to text on a readable text um, tool. We've built our platform to be web accessible and also to with a module on the back end that teaches the event organizer how to cater to accessibility and what the questions are that they should be asking. So for example, at the ICC, the International Convention Center, it's not enough to know the location because if you've ever been there, it's like two kilometers wide um, and there's lots of different areas in it. And it's hard enough when you've got your vision to find the small conference that you're going to there at any given day. And so if you're blind catching an Uber there and you need to tell your Uber driver, drop me off specifically here. So you need more than just a Google Maps address. And so we have eight questions the event organizer can fill out that gives someone with a disability the confidence and information they need to successfully attend an event without it blowing out into a disaster. Mm -hmm. It's now evolved to like event organizers who might be blind, for example, or vision impaired is the right way to say it, um, actually able to use the back end of our software to manage their events. And that's pretty cool. And uh, we've got future ideas um, and things we're implementing but aren't really working yet. Like, uh, you know, you can search events on our website and if you're in a wheelchair, you can filter by wheelchair access. And that's a really nice thing if you're in a wheelchair because you don't have to waste time looking at events that don't actually facilitate you entering the event. And, you know, that's not used that much yet because people don't know that much about it. And so, you know, there's more work to be done on this, but we're, we're on that journey.